Um, even when I'm behind closed doors, I still try to remain a level of professional, although I'm in the privacy of my own home. Um, <clears throat> and I'm very disappointed in myself, um, not for the act. Um, I think there are millions and billions of people uh, of consenting age that engage in activities. Um, but but to have your most intimate detail on the audio to be heard, I'm disappointed in myself. <laughs>get right into this man with shannon sharp with this ig live situation you see this phone this phone right here this phone right here it's a very powerful powerful tool it's a powerful tool and if you're not careful or responsible with it it can mess you up good or bad but what i've I have to call Cap on is that he owned up to it eventually because a lot of people just didn't believe him. When he first came out, he said it was a hack. A lot of people don't believe that. You know why a lot of people don't believe that? Because when you go to Instagram, there are several steps that you have to do before you go live. It's not like you can just hit one button. And it automatically goes live, right? And when you add upon that, if you getting it on with somebody else, why do you have your phone near you? Why is your phone near you? It doesn't make any sense. You know, I, I there could be several theories here. What um could be, was this a stunt? Was this a skit? Was this a stage play to throw people off? Was it? Because it don't make really sense. Is this something that you are, is there something that you are ashamed of? Is there something that you want to throw people off on? Was this a manipulation game? Because it doesn't seem right. If you really think about it, it doesn't seem right. Now, I don't care what Shannon Sharp's sexual preference is. I don't care. All I'm saying is when you go on the nightcap and then you tell Chad Ocho Cinco that guess who was the first person that called me, Chad? And then you say it was Cat Williams. And then you go out your way to say that Cat Williams said, you ain't gay today. Why? Why say that? Why say that? Why Why go all out your way at this time? Because apparently there's a, that you went live and it was sounding like you was getting it on with a woman or with somebody. Why? Why? I don't understand. I don't. But let's listen to what Cameron had to say about this. You can't go live without pushing like four or five buttons. That nigga cap is, bro. You, you got to push like four <laughs> buttons to go live. You know how you pocket down somebody and you be like, oh, I called you by. Yeah, yeah. because you, you, buy, you had to get a drink. You pocket down a lot, of course. <laughs> Because it's just, you hit the button. Live, you got to go to Instagram. Then you got to go to post. Then you got to go to live. Then they make sure that, do you, you sure you want to go live? Yeah. You got to hit four things to go live. And to me, that was, my, he ain't go viral in a little minute. <laughs> and he's like, yo, let me go viral. Because look, <laughs> let's check out the whole scenario, America. Look, first of all, I have a few things to say about this. The, the, the vocals is too clear. How you hear it that clear if you write not next to your phone? Sound like he had a mic Larry was selling me. Sound like he had the air. <laughs> it's mad clear. You know what I'm saying? That's first and foremost. Secondly, 
You go up and apologize, but at the same time with your apology, you said, yo, Chad, I told you I'd get it in, man. I told you, I, I told you I'm getting in. <laughs> so you apologize in the ESPN, then you're bragging. Thirdly, you say, you know who called me today? Cat Williams, he said, you ain't gay today. Why you gotta make an announcement you ain't gay? If people say you gay, whatever. <laughs> who cares? I don't think you need to make an announcement. I, I will think a lot of my career, people be like, hey, Cam is gay, Cam is gay. And I'll be like, bring your mother around and see what happens if you bring your mother around or your sister. Let's see how gay I am. I don't need to make an announcement that I'm not gay. I'm not. I, I mean, at the end of the day, Shannon Sharp is a grown man. Do what you do, man. I I don't care what people say about me. I'm a content creator. I've had so many people go go in my comments and say a whole lot of things. Let me tell you something. You you have to have thick skin. You you have to have a short term memory. You can't worry about because see half of those people that's talking crap about you. They ain't got nothing going on their damn self. They ain't doing nothing with themselves. They, they, they're they not happy with themselves. They're miserable. Mis misery loves company. And if somebody do critique or say something that you feel is negative, who cares? Keep doing you. Put your blinders on. Who, who cares? At the end of the day, man, live for you. Live your life because life is too precious. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the Shannon Sharp thing, man, in the comment section, man. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Take care.